So Jesus, uh, finally telling us to quit playing games with uh, time, it's in Acts 1.8. But you will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes on you, and you'll be my witnesses in Jerusalem, and all Judea and Samaria, and the ends of the earth. If um, the national kingdom they wanted uh, would be delayed, the power they needed would not. And they would soon receive power with the coming of the Holy Spirit. This power is a, uh, the word power is a word dynamite. It changes things. Um, same word is used to describe the gospel. It's dynamite. It's explosive. It, it uh, changes things. God's power changes people, not overthrows government. It uh, made witnesses, those who have experienced power. So here's the evangelism plan. Acts 1 through 7 describes the gospel in Jerusalem. And Jerusalem was where Jesus was executed at the word of an angry mob. Interesting. This is uh, his plan. Acts 8 through 12 speaks of the gospel in Judea and Samaria. Judea rejected his ministry. Samaria was regarded as a wasteland of impure impure half-breeds. Acts 13 through 28 tells the gospel going to the other most parts of the Gentile world. And, uh, and a lot of Jews thought it was just uh, the Gentiles were merely fuel for the fires of hell. Acts 1, 9, after he said this, he was taken up before their very eyes, and a cloud hid him from their sight. Taken up uh, has the concept of exaltation. Uh, the cloud... Uh, is suggestive of the Shekinah glory uh, of uh, Jesus that's uh, that associated with God of the Old Testament and New Testament. Acts 1, 10 through 12 uh, goes on, and it says, While they looked steadfastly toward heaven, as he went up, and behold, two men stood by him in white apparel, uh, who also said, Men of Galilee, why do you stand gazing up into heaven, this uh, same Jesus was taken up from you into heaven, so come in like manner you saw him go into heaven. The two men apparently are angels, and, um, uh, and to put their attention in the right place. He, he says, you know, get to the mission at hand. Don't be wondering what's going on in the clouds. So uh, this is a, a beautiful picture, and it says when Jesus left, uh, he will uh, return in the same way. He left physically, will come physically. He left visibly, same, same way he's coming back. He left from the Mount of Olives, and so he'll come in the like manner. He left in the presence of his disciples and will come in the same manner. He left blessing his church and will come back in the same manner.